I think working out with your boss gives you an opportunity to learn about each other, and in particular, it gives your boss an opportunity to learn about you. I made a decision that I was going to make fitness a really important part of my life, and that I was no longer going to make a workout the last thing on my priority list, and, and I wasn't going to cancel it necessarily if something else came up. And so I would say to people, I can meet with you in the office, or if you want, I go to the gym every day for an hour, and you can have an hour with me if you come to the gym. And people began taking me up on it. I always give people an option. They, not everyone's as interested in going to the gym as I am. I thought it was a little unconventional because frankly I'd never heard of meeting someone over a workout, right? And I hadn't known Strauss at that point, so I didn't know that he was, this was something he's super passionate about. You know, I could see some people getting uncomfortable with certain types of workouts, where it's like, hey, I don't, I don't want to do a heavy weights workout with my boss. But for me, I would say there's, there's no discomfort or awkwardness. The only awkwardness is when he kicks my butt because he's just more fit than I am. You have a cup of coffee to talk about business, you're there to talk about business. If you're in the gym, you're there to have a workout and business will creep in and creep out and maybe you'll get to know each other. We'll talk about deals and we'll talk about one's personal life. As personal as it gets might be, hey, how's your dating life or who you dating or you know, what's your social life like? Because your boss also isn't interested in making it just about work. Otherwise, you'd be sitting in his or her office, right, just talking about work. In the same way that people play golf with colleagues and business associates, it's an opportunity to be involved in an activity that hopefully you both enjoy, I just don't play golf. All right.